Welcome to this AutoCAD tutorial. Today, we're going to explore all the parameters available in AutoCAD Silences, so you can get the most out of your silence removal. First, open AutoCAD Silences and select the part of your timeline you want to work on. Once you've made your selection, click Validate. Now comes the interesting part, the Settings panel. This is where you'll fine-tune your silence removal for the best results. Let's start with the Noise Threshold. This defines the volume level below which audio will be considered silence. The higher the threshold, the more noise will be removed. Next, we have pacing, which controls the rhythm of your cuts. You can choose a faster or slower pace, depending on the energy you want in your video. For more precise control, check out the advanced settings below. Remove silence longer than and keep talk longer than lets you decide exactly how long a silence must be before it's removed and how long speech segments should remain intact. Padding before and padding after can help your edit feel more natural by keeping a small buffer of silence before and after each cut. The silence management section is great if you want to decide how silences will appear in your timeline. For example, muting them instead of cutting them. Then, choose a transition to smooth out your edits you have the choice between G-Cut, which is audio from the next clip starts before its visuals appear, L-Cut, which is audio from the previous clip continues over the next visuals, and Constant Power is smooth crossfade between two audio clips. Finally, generate a preview to make sure everything looks right. And that's it! You now know how to use every setting in AutoCut Silences to create clean, natural edits. Don't forget that AutoCut provides a 14 days free trial, no credit card required.